YouTube. Hey, everybody. You guys know who it is. It's Q. And you know how I do when I'm kicking it with you. Yes, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Q Food Reviews. And like I always do, let me start off by saying thank you to my subscribers. I most definitely want to say thank you to the new ones as well. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching. And welcome to the team, my baby. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, listen to me. I'm holding on, baby. I'm hanging in here. I know you guys can hear it in my voice. I'm very congested. I have a stuffy, runny nose. I have a cough. And all of that is because I'm under the weather. But as you can see, I'm highly committed to my squad, my team, and my channel. And the show must go on, ladies and gentlemen, okay? Ladies and gentlemen, listen to me. I have a trending topic to talk about this morning, okay? A lot of the fellas, okay, from the neighborhood wanted me to talk about this, okay? A lot of people brought this to my attention, okay? This is what's trending right now. And what am I talking about, ladies and gentlemen? This is from the hip-hop artist, okay? He's a former hip-hop artist, and his name is Young Jock, okay? What this topic is going to be about this morning, ladies and gentlemen, is that this was a former hip-hop artist, okay, that used to do his thing back in the day. And what happened is he's trying to lead by a good example by being an Uber driver, okay. He works for an Uber company, and basically everybody clowning my man about it, okay. But he said the purpose of him doing it is to be an example for our youth. Okay, to let them know that they can make an honest living outside of being a drug dealer, okay, or just living the life of crime, period, okay. That's basically what it was all about. I'm going to give you my thoughts and opinion on this, and uh, we're going to get it on. As far as I'm concerned, I feel like this, okay, and this is my honest opinion, ladies and gentlemen. Another thing that I want this to be understood too is to my young subscribers as well. Tiandre and all y'all, listen to me, all right? Little man, all of y'all, listen to me. Hear me out when I say this because it's real. It's not meant for all of us to be a rapper, a football player, okay? All of us can't be that. You understand what I'm saying? Just the typical stereotype for a black man, okay? I guess most people feel if they're not a rapper, okay, a football player, a basketball player, they can't make it. Well, that's untrue, okay? What you have to realize is everybody is not gifted and talented to be a rapper, to be a football player, and to be a basketball player, okay? Some of you have to take what God gave you and be good at it, okay? Whatever it is that God give you, he give us all gifts and attributes, okay? Whatever it is, the talent that God give you, use it to your advantage to better yourself and be who you really are. You understand where I'm coming from? Ladies and gentlemen, let me use me as a perfect example, okay? God gave me what you call a gift of gab. And as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, I'm using it for my advantage. And I'm using this gift of gab for the good, to touch people all across the world, to inspire people and motivate people and uplift people. That's what I'm using this gift of gab for, okay? That's one gift God gave me. He also gave me a gift of strength and power, okay? I lift weights, I exercise. I, 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 I stay physically fit, okay? I go walking every morning, as you guys can see. I keep it moving. That right there is a gift and an attribute within itself, okay? And also, I was blessed with good looks and handsomeness and things like that. And I don't, how can I say this, ladies and gentlemen? I don't boast and brag, okay? And post pictures of me on Instagram and things like that. No, 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 no. I just acknowledge the beauty, the natural beauty that God has given me, okay? I kept myself physically fit and in shape and everything. I had no surgeries to look like this. This is all natural. You follow me on where I'm coming from, ladies and gentlemen? So what I'm trying to tell you is this, guys, especially to my young subscribers. 
I saw the potential that God put within me and I used it to my advantage throughout my life, okay? I have great worth ethics. That's why I have my own business, okay? I have great people skills. That's why I have my own channel, okay? It's what he gives you, okay? He tells you in the scripture to multiply and be fruitful, okay? Not meaning by having a whole bunch of kids by a bunch of different women that you know you can't take care of. <laughs> My father wasn't saying being fruitful in that sense, okay? What he was saying is being fruitful as far as being productive, okay? And being and showing progression, okay? So again, to our youth, I want to share some other things with y'all, Tiandre and y'all, because I feel like for him to do that, it was definitely to let it be known that, okay, you have to stay humble in this world that we live in, ladies and gentlemen, okay? You will never get too high and think you too good, okay, for God not to knock you off that high horse and humble you, as you can see, okay? So listen, we're going to carry on with this conversation because it's a good topic to talk about. I'm glad it was brought to my attention, okay? Just let me grab me a quick bite to eat, ladies and gentlemen, and we're going to continue on, okay? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I tell you, this guy, I remember when he first came out being a rapper, I remember that, and they're saying that he fell off and, and things like that because he's not, you know, relevant anymore, but what it was, he was a part of this program, okay, and this was a, a big brother, big sister program that he was enrolled, you know, enrolled himself in, and he was doing this for our youth, okay? He basically humbled himself to do it, okay? Now, listen, I'm going to give you all the information that you need, okay, to go and watch the video for yourself, okay? I want you to go online, go to Google, okay? Type in TMZ, okay, and you will see the story on Young Jock for yourself. You can see the video footage and the clip for yourself, okay? Hang on, you guys. We're going to carry on. Let me grab me a quick bite to eat, okay? Because I, I, I tell you, anytime, okay, somebody tries to inspire you, not good. Look at that cheese, you too. Yes, baby, nothing but the best. And you guys know, Q love his breakfast sandwiches. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. Give me a second, ladies and gentlemen. Father, bless us in the name of Jesus. Yes, breakfast is the most important meal of the day. I stress it all the time. the way I was raised. <laughs> now listen to me. Tiandre and y'all, little man, look at me, look. There is no in-between. It's either you're doing right or you're doing wrong. There is no in-between, okay? So what you guys have to decide is what do you want to do, okay, with your life? And once you decide that this is what you want to do, go ahead and pursue it. Set goals in your life. You can be whatever it is that you guys want to be. And like Tiandre, Little Man, and all of y'all, sky's the limit, okay? And this is America, the land of opportunities, okay? So you guys can be whatever it is that you want to be, okay? You have the option to go out into this world and do whatever it is that you want to do. But you have to make the right decision. You have to make the right choice. Life is about decisions, ladies and gentlemen, okay? And in this thing called life, sometimes we make right decisions, and sometimes we make wrong decisions, but that's what life teaches you. You live and you learn, okay? And, and that's what's important, all right? Now, listen to me. To my young subscribers, because I got a lot of them out there. If your desire 
is to want to do music, okay? Then pursue that music, okay? I don't want you going dropping a mixtape one week and you look around, you ain't dropped no more joints since then. I don't know about that. Are you sure you want to be a rapper? I don't want you, okay, to go sign up for the basketball squad. You come to practice one day, coach ain't seen you in two weeks. Uh, are you sure you want to who? I don't know. I say all that to say this, ladies and gentlemen, listen to me. And to, our, to my youth, y'all, when I went to school, okay, I went to Detroit Persian High School, I was very active. I played two sports. Uh, a, a young version of Bo Jackson. <laughs> you might as well could say, okay? The sports I participated in was swimming and baseball, okay? I didn't excel at football and basketball because you know why I chose those other two sports? Because I was the man, all right? Everybody want to be the man playing basketball. Everybody want to be the man in football. But I got into lanes with sports to where I excel, and I was the MVP. You follow me on where I'm coming from? That's what I'm trying to tell y'all, DeAndre. It's not meant for everybody to be a football player. It's not meant for everybody to be a hooper. It's not meant for everybody to be a rapper. There's other things that you can be in life, okay? It's just like me, little man. I'm my own man. I'm self-made, and it's a beautiful thing from the most high, okay? I have my own landscaping company. I have my own YouTube channel. I'm self-made. I'm my own man. You follow me on where I'm coming from? I look like this and I'm built like this is because of my past, okay? I was active in sports. I was productive throughout my whole life. I work every day. I work out. I exercise. So once you, okay, build yourself, okay, like this, okay, now what you will start to realize, okay, now your body is built this way. You understand where I'm coming from? Now this is the way that you're built, okay? And God built us to last. You follow me on where I'm coming from, okay? You have to put yourself in a position to where you can wake up every day and say, this is what I want, I'm finna go get it. You gotta be a go-getter in this world that we live in, y'all, okay? So any dreams that you guys may have, any ambitions that you may have, anything that you want to do in life, okay, T. Andre and y'all, Y'all can do it, okay? Don't let nobody tell y'all what y'all cannot do and what y'all cannot become. Because you can be anything that you want to be and you can become anything you want to become in this thing called life, okay? Now, what you will encounter is this throughout life, okay? Especially if you involved in sports, okay? Because I have a very competitive nature, okay? You're going to get this a lot, T. Andre and y'all. You're going to have people to tell y'all, you can't do it. You ain't going to make it. You ain't going to make the team. You might as well quit, bro. Uh-uh. No, DeAndre, y'all. Uh-uh. Let that go in this ear and go out the other. You know why they sit there and tell you things like that? Because they don't want to see you excel. They don't want to see you, okay, get that scholarship, okay, to go to that college, okay? They don't want to see you getting accepted into the league, getting drafted into the league, okay? Because they couldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? So the words of encouragement that I'm giving you guys is this. No matter what hardship lives bring, Okay, life brings a lot of hardship, a lot of trials and tribulations and things like that. Okay, but you cannot let it stop you from reaching your dreams. We all have dreams and ambition. Okay, and a lot of times us as humans, it's always human nature. We have a tendency of getting discouraged when things don't go the way we plan and things don't work out the way we want them to. We had a tendency of doing that, okay? But what I'm telling you guys is this, okay? Don't get discouraged, okay? And don't give up, all right? Pursue your dreams, okay? You can be whatever you want to be, Tiandre and y'all, and I want you guys to make me proud of y'all one day, okay? And basically what Young Jock is saying is that there is a way to make an honest living, okay? Back in my day, Tiandre and y'all, we didn't have a thing such as it's Uber, okay? We had cabs, <laughs> all right? But the world that created, okay, this source to where it makes people comfortable, okay? It makes it, you know, 
easier and it's easier access for people to get transportation and it's also another means of people able to make them a living okay and make them some money okay and it's called uber all right so again ladies and gentlemen that's my thoughts and opinion on this video i felt like you know that was a good thing young jock did even though the world tried to shame him for it and clown him for it but it is what it is okay we need more people to inspire our youth and our young generation because ladies and gentlemen you know, we losing a lot of them. You know, a lot of them is killing each other. You know, the police is taking them out. You know, so I pray for our youth and our young generation. And that's why I try to reach Tiandre and them the best way I can as far as leading an example, okay? I cannot live their lives for them. I only can lead by a good example. And hopefully I was able to do just that, okay? Tiandre and all of y'all, I'm getting ready to let you guys go. This wasn't the lecture, okay? This was a story that was brought to my attention, okay? This is what's trending right now, so I thought I wanted to go ahead and talk about it as well, all right? Another thing before I let you guys get out of here, I just want you guys to know I appreciate you guys so much for subscribing to the channel, checking out my videos, watching me and supporting me. I appreciate you guys so much, okay? I want you guys to try to stay warm, okay? Go ahead and enjoy the rest of your day. It's a beautiful morning here in Michigan. It's just extremely cold, okay? If you guys decide to get out and go to work, just bundle up real good because it's extremely cold. Tasha, Nini, and Teresa, y'all, put some kids on some gloves on their hands so they won't get frostbit because it's cold, okay? It's very cold, all right? Before you guys get out of here, I'm getting ready to let you guys go. Can you guys do me a favor? Please, ladies and gentlemen, okay? Hit the like button, all right? Share my content and ask them to subscribe, okay? Ask them to join the team and the family. Ladies and gentlemen, we pushing over almost 1,500 subscribers. Actually, we'll get to the 1,400 before we get to the 1,500. <laughs> I just set that mark there because, ladies and gentlemen, you got to set goals, okay? How will you know where you're headed if you don't know where you're going, okay? All right? So with all that being said, again, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for watching. May God bless you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, God bless, and peace, Q Nation. I love all of y'all, and y'all be safe, and y'all be careful. And again, Tiandre, y'all can be whatever it is that y'all want to be in life, okay? Life is about decisions, and hopefully you guys will make some good ones. Thank you, God bless, and peace, y'all.